Hey peeps, I am back with a collective haul today. So these are all the clothes, but it's gonna be a few other things that aren't clothes. So we're gonna go ahead and get straight into it. But first, make sure you pump the brakes. Make sure you subscribe to your girl. Go ahead and like this video because you already know you're gonna love it. And make sure you comment down below and let me know what your favorite piece is, if you shopped with any of these people before. And also let me know if you wanna see like styling videos and things like that because I'm so over buying clothes. I just feel like maybe to be more creative and give y'all something a little bit more, it would be better to style than to just show y'all the items. So let me know if you guys want that and let's go ahead and get straight into the collective haul. So the first thing we have here are some Desi sunglasses. So let me just show y'all. I got the 2000s, the pink like gradient. Like we. So let's go ahead and try these on. Ooh, ooh. Do y'all see it or do you see it? These are so cute, like Desi, you did that, you did that. And let me show y'all like the packaging and stuff. The box that it comes in says Desi. And then the box comes in this like plastic. Then the sunglasses are in this plastic and they have plastic that comes like on the actual part that goes on your ears. And then this is the cute box. And then like this, like Desi really been putting that work, pregnant and all, okay? And it does come with this like little like duster bag that says Desi on the bottom. So these are the other sunglasses that I got. So as you can see, these are still like how they came. So you see they have like one on just one end. I guess that's all you need for it like not to get like damaged or scratched up. So that's what she has right there. So let's take these 2000s off. And these are the on red. Now these really don't fit my face that well. They will slip, but because I have the wig on, they aren't slipping. So I guess that's the trick. Wear it with a wig. Mm -mm. These are the on red, like the tortoise. And OMG, like I just thought that this style, like the shape was just so different. Like <gasps> gagging, period. I just love these y'all. I love them so much. It says Desi on the actual like glasses. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it says Desi right here. I don't think it's gonna focus enough. And then on the inner part, it says Desi. On the other side, it says the style on red. On here, because it's like thinner right here, on red is like right here. I mean, it says 2000s right here, just on that thicker part. And then it says Desi. It actually just says Desi right here. You guys can't see it because it's just not gonna focus enough. But uh, like y'all, let me show y'all with like just the gray background. I had to support my girl Desi, been watching her for so long and I just am so happy for her, the baby like, uh, Oh, so happy for her having the baby, her and Steven, and I am happy that she's able to do her brand and have a baby like she is the illest. Then I got some jewelry from Zara. So this is just like a boutique, like jewelry boutique type of place. And it is called Zara and it came in this packaging. And then these are the two necklaces that I got. So it says Zara right here and Zara right there. And then one of them is like the big Zeddy chain. So this is the regular chain. And when you put these on, they sparkle something serious, y'all. They really be sparkling. Like, I love that. I'm not gonna try them on, but I will link their Instagram and everything so you can see them. So this is how the big one came in like a little pouch. So this is how you like lock it on there. So that's how you put the necklace on. And then here is the chain. I will leave like all the names and everything for it down below. I also got these earrings. Now I think she's called the Ohio Clay Girl, Clay Girl. So I will link 
her information down below and these are made out of polymer polymer clay I don't know if I'm saying that right but I thought that these were really cute something to wear with a basic outfit to like spice it up if you're wearing like a bun or something you could put these earrings on and it'll just be like a nice little like statement piece to a simple outfit so I really liked these they are handmade by a smaller brand so make sure you support small brands then I got these Kelly and Kate shoes. I was gonna wear this for like my birthday, but then my sister told me not to wear these, but I still like them just as a neutral shoe, as a nude shoe for like someone that's brown to kind of wear with anything. So I really like these. I also like the fact that this is more of a kitten heel, so definitely easy to walk in. So if you guys have ever looked for a brown shoe, Kelly and Kate have them. Yeah, so let's go ahead and move on to like the actual like clothing items. I have a bunch as you can see and i'm just i'm so over buying clothes y'all like i'm so over it so this shirt is from coatcheck.co so you definitely can check her out she pretty much like upcycles these and like thrifts them and then like makes them into her own so i got two of these shirts and i definitely need to style these on instagram so i just think that this is so unique and she, like she did all the stitching and I think this is just like a chill shirt to like throw on, but like it's so different that it still like makes you like stand out, but in a super casual, simple way, like not doing too much at all. The bottoms don't have a seam. They're just kind of like jagged and cut. So that's the only thing I would say is like, I wish that they had just like a seam right there. Y'all, why didn't I notice? that this is the shirt with the pocket. So I also thought that it was really cool that the pocket like wasn't a full pocket. That's why I got this shirt is mostly cause of the pocket. Like I just thought the way that it's, you know, cut around the pocket makes this piece unique. Also, as you can see, like that is a burgundy and gray. So definitely like fall colors. And this green one is fall colors as well. I need to hurry up and style these before it's not fall anymore. But yeah, so then this one is like the same type of situation, but instead it is three different colors. Super baggy, comfortable, like you can lounge around in the house with it. So make sure y'all check her out, coatcheck.co. Y'all, look at me. Do you see it? 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 I look so put together. Is this me? Is this you, Amber Charmaine? Y'all, if you want to look snatched on the casual tip, like this is the this is the fit <laughs> do you see it okay let me stop okay so on to what this is and where it's from so this shirt is from zara come on you knew you knew it's from zara because zara do everybody right look at this shirt look at the color look at the color you gotta stop playing. You gotta stop playing. This is a size extra small, small. So it fits so good. Oh, it is a bodysuit. And it's not, I don't know if it's, it's not super thongy. It's not super thongy. It kind of covers my butt way more than a thong. So we love that. Cause over here in these streets, I don't like the thong bodysuits. I don't like them. I wear them, but I don't like them. So um, here are the express pants. So really there's nothing to the bottoms. Like they're literally the same, y'all. These are the skinny dim, I'm sorry, skinny mid-rise zero R. And I wanted to make sure I got mid-rise cause I am short. If you are short, <sighs> The high rise pants are just not it. Or not even if you're just short, but if you have a short torso. Cause some people are short and like all their length is in their torso. My length that I do have, it's in my legs. Okay, not in my torso y'all. So I cannot do the high rise. So I really want mid rise and low rise pants only. Like the high rise trend, when will it die? When? <laughs> I don't know. 
but look at how good these fit yes i just love how these fit giving y'all all the angles <laughs> y'all i'm about to wear it is okay y'all so i have these like leather pants and then it's kind of like it's not necessarily suede but it's it's kind of different it's this ruffle thing happening on the side so it's a different material but it's like i think it's i'm pretty sure it's faux leather but it's like the it's the sh it's the shiny kind that you see people wearing i forget the name that you call it, it has a specific name if you want it to be the shiny kind but then it's not like shiny on the side with the ruffles but as soon as i saw these on instagram i was like i have to have these i have to have them they zip right here in the front and it is a metal like silver zipper it does say the name of the brand on the zipper it's i think it's french so i'm not saying this right i know i'm not it's manure devour but i think in french you don't pronounce the r's so i don't know um but it will be linked down below it says leaders in design and quality and this is quality on the inside it's soft so it's easy to put on and take off like that's literally amazing and what you need in a leather pant and i just think the butt area looks so good i love how like the way this kind of cinches you in at the waist like that's so cute and this is a size four that i got these pants in on to the next thing y'all <laughs> So I just put my express pants back on and just to show y'all like this super casual look. So this is a shirt that I got from Zara as well. And this is in an extra small. So this specific shirt, I did want it to fit really good. And of course it already is like a kind of um, oversized shirt. So it's going to fit good in terms of it being oversized. So it is still a little bit loose right here, but it is fitting on the arms. And I really like this shirt because of it being like a quarter length shirt. So definitely just something super casual. And then I got this shirt in another color. So let me go ahead and show you that one. So really this shirt actually is different from the other one. The sleeves are not the same type of sleeves. And also the shirt, the fabric is different. And I'm sorry y'all, I don't have on a bra. <laughs> but um, the shirt fabric is different, it's softer. So I'll make sure that I'll link the correct kind of shirt that this is from the Zara website, but it's casual, it's loose. I wanted this to fit loose, so I got this in a size medium. So this is what the medium looks like on me, a skinny mini. Hope you guys can see like the difference in the sleeve. Sorry I didn't get close with the other shirt. But yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the next items. We are almost done. So I'm just gonna throw this right on top. This is a blazer by the brand Julie Mango. Check them out on Instagram. I'm not sure if they have a website right now, but they probably do. Um, if they do, I will definitely link it. And yeah, they are called Julie Mango. They do like thrifting and, you know, just reselling and stuff like that. So this is an oversized red blazer and this is literally exactly what I was looking for and I was gonna thrift it but she did it all for me. I wanna wear this with a hoodie. So that's why I needed it to be oversized and not my actual size, but I could just wear it with anything and do like an oversized look. I mean, honestly, I don't think this fit like looks too bad. What do you think? But yeah, and then it has pockets. So like this is like one of a kind, like it's not like she has like multiple of these because it is thrifted, but she just has like good pieces. So if you are looking for someone who resells and thrifts and has good pieces, check out Julie Mango. Okay, so next up is my Static John shirt. This is such a good quality. If you guys don't know who Static John is, Static John is Katie's husband. I think they're married, but I'm pretty sure they're not boyfriend and girlfriend anymore. Um, but yeah, Katie's, I'm sorry y'all, this hair is 
all in my way from trying on these clothes. So Static John is Katie's husband and he came out with like his own shirts because he like has all these sayings. More so my little sister watches them. And then she was telling me that she wanted to get the shirt and then she showed me it and like everything that it said. And I thought that this looked so good and that the saying was so bomb. So look, it says, I'm human, I bleed. That's such a good quote. Like we are all human, we all, you know, you know, bleed the same, breathe the same, die the same, like got here the same way, you know? We are all human. So he says, I'm human, I bleed with like a little like droplet of blood. And I just think that is the best thing ever. Y'all, look at this dress. Let me back up just a little bit more. Hopefully y'all can see it. And it comes low. Period. Do y'all see this? Y'all, this dress is so cute. And then it has like these thumb holes. It's like a tie-dye red dress. And then it has ruching on the side all the way down. And it's giving body yaddy 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 yaddy. Hey, stop playing. I love this so much, like, oh, give it to him, give it to him, give it, give it, give it to him. Yes, this is so cute. I wish I could wear this somewhere, I wish, but obviously not gonna be able to anytime soon, but I'ma keep it until I can. Oh, Kurt, how do y'all feel about this dress? Do y'all love this? Is this too ghetto fabulous? Is this just enough, too much? What do you think? I, I love me a good little ghetto fabulous look. Like, it's nothing to take it there. It's nothing. Uh, ooh, ooh. But we are actually going to go ahead and sophisticate it up just a little bit because we want to get into my birthday dress. My birthday dress. Wait. My birthday dress is from an upscale little place. So let's go ahead and take a look at what that dress is looking like. Okay, peeps, so last item. This is my birthday dress from House of CB. And this is literally so cute. And wait, first let me tell y'all that the dress from Battyville that the last dress I had on was a size small. And then this is a size small. I have bought the extra small at first and when I got it, I could not zip it up. So this is where the zipper is on the side. I could not zip it up and then I had to try and get my sister to help me and she was like, mm -mm, it's not going and I don't wanna do too much and then um, you can't even return or exchange the dress at all. One thing I really don't like is that it like buckles right here. So you see how it's like causing this extra like lumpiness on the side because of the zipper. I'm like, why couldn't y'all just put the zipper in the back? Please tell me, I don't know. Maybe because of the frill, the frill, cause the zipper kind of starts right here, but you could have started the zipper right here above the frill, just like you did right here. So that's the only thing. I just feel like I spent too much money for it to be doing that. Um, so you just kind of, kind of have to like, <laughs> do your body a certain type of way if you really don't want to have that in a picture or something. And then I just love all the detail. I love this. Now you just gotta be careful with this dress because it can rip. It, it probably can rip and I've just been so, 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 so careful. I'm gonna get this dry clean. There's no way that I would ever wash this myself. And I'm sure with a $200 dress, you heard it, 200. <laughs> $200 dress, you are not supposed to wash this yourself. And then it does have these drawstrings so you can make it like sh as short as you want. And then it like causes like this little diagonal thing. And it actually goes lower than I have it right now. And then you can draw, string it up if you want to. Tell me what you think about this dress. Is it too much for y'all? Like. <laughs> Y'all, I'm the most, so it was it was everything for me. 
But yeah, that was the last item. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was a lot. I don't know how long this video is about to be, but I hope that you guys like this collective haul of just everything I've been accumulating the last couple of months. And I really am going to try and do styling videos just so I'm not continuously buying things. And make sure you subscribe, make sure you like and comment down below your favorite part of the video item from the video and all of that is going to help us get to 5k and when we hit 5k it's going to be a big giveaway mm -hmm. so i will see y'all later in the next video thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next video peace